dear Director General of Irina, my dear friend Francesco La Camara, distinguished delegates, ladies and gentlemen, I expect to be in Abu Dhabi for this Irina Assembly. Once again, the pandemic has prevented us from meeting in person. But I must commend the Irina for rapidly adapting the assembly to a virtual format. Last year, we had the chance to share perspectives on how to ensure that the energy transition would be at the heart of our recovery efforts from the effects of COVID-19. Since then, we have structured Brazil's view of the future program and the National Hydrogen Program, two new ambitious policies with a long-term perspective that will foster additional decarbonization solutions and synergies with the other clean energy policies in place. The deployment of renewables is strong and accelerating in Brazil. Wind power was almost 50% of total additional installed capacity in 2021, having reached over 20 gigawatts in total. We are also moving forward with the regulatory framework for offshore winds. Distributed generation is also pushing renewables forward, mostly solar PV, but also biogas and small hydro. Solar grew from 4.8 to 8.7 gigawatts in 2021, and we have just approved a new legal framework for distributed generation that will provide security and predictability for those investing in this sector. To connect some of the most competitive and diverse renewables in the world, we need grids. This is why we continue to expand the enabling transmission infrastructure in a proactive transmission planning process. Transmission auctions have been very successful and we already have studies and a plan to double interconnection capacity between north and south of Brazil, increasing the flexibility and the resilience of our national interconnected system. Dear Director General, let me repeat one thing I said last year and I had the occasion to tell you in person last November when I visit Irina. For five decades, renewables have been at the heart of Brazil's energy planning and policies. Having one of the highest shares of renewables in the world is not by chance. It is more than natural that we value the work done by Arena and with Arena. The agents has developed a comprehensive and inclusive perspective that we believe is key for a successful and just energy transition. We are now looking forward to collaborating with the agency on the REMAP South America project. I believe it is an opportunity to combine global and regional perspectives to increase the effectiveness of our policies and promote mutual understanding and collaboration. Thank you very much and wish of a very productive year for the agents.